I think this is a very personal question. Um, I used to, again, think that if you went past like three or four hours without eating that you were, you were like on death's door. Okay, now I feel like I'm on death's door if I go longer than four hours without eating. And I'm assuming Jeb is the same way. Um, and that's like some genetic stuff that maybe the two of us have going on. But um, at the end of the day, no, it doesn't matter. I mean, you can do, you can intermittent fast and you can eat all your food in one meal in the, or in like an eight hour or even smaller window. And as long as you're getting enough protein and you're getting enough calories or you're eating the appropriate amount of calories for what your goals are, it doesn't really matter how it's uh, spread out so much for weight. It is going to it is going to have an effect on your performance and it is going to have a, an effect on sustainability. So if I'm just starving all the time because I'm trying to do, do intermittent fasting, uh, that's not sustainable for me and I need to figure it out. Now, if eating every two hours is unrealistic for my lifestyle and that's not sustainable for me, then that's also not a good idea. So you have to figure out what works for you. I would say the most important part is making sure that you have, you know, the balance across the macronutrients and figuring out how that fits into your day and your schedule the best.